Your ophthalmologist has diagnosed a detached retina. This condition occurs when the tissue lining the back of your eye is lifted or pulled away. A detached retina is a very serious condition that almost always causes blindness if not treated. To repair your retina, your eye surgeon recommends surgery to put a sclerobuckle around your eye. This surgery can help to prevent further retinal damage and save your sight. To understand how a detached retina affects your vision, let's take a look at how the eye works. Light rays enter the eye through the cornea, pupil, and lens. These light rays are focused on the retina, the light-sensitive tissue lining the back of the eye. The retina has two areas, the peripheral retina, which gives us our side or wide-angle vision, and the macula, the small area in the center of the retina. The macula gives us our pinpoint vision, allowing us to see detail clearly. The inner eye is filled with a clear, jelly-like substance called vitreous. As we age, the vitreous becomes less like jelly and more like liquid. Usually, the vitreous is only loosely attached to the retina, so as the eye moves, the vitreous moves away from the retina without causing problems. Sometimes, though, the vitreous pulls hard enough to tear the retina. Fluid passes through the tear and lifts the retina off the back of the eye. This is called a retinal detachment. The retina doesn't work when it is detached and vision becomes blurred. A retinal detachment is a very serious problem that almost always causes blindness, unless it is treated. Your ophthalmologist will repair your retina with a scleral buckle. This procedure is usually done in the operating room and your eye surgeon will use either a local or general anesthesia. During sclerobuckle surgery, your ophthalmologist will place a small plastic, rubber, or silicone band around the sclera, the outside of the eyeball. The band is sewn to the sclera and cannot be seen after surgery. This band gently presses the eye inward, helping to keep the separated layers of the eye together and allowing the retina to reattach to the eye's interior wall. In most cases, the sclerobuckle will be left on the eye permanently. It's important to remember that retinal detachment is a very serious eye condition. The eye may take several months to fully heal, and your vision may be permanently changed, even after healing is complete. The retina is very sensitive tissue, and the damage caused by retinal detachment could result in loss of vision in the eye, even with successful surgery. As with any surgery, there are risks of side effects and complications with scleral buckling. These may include bleeding in the eye, infection inside or on the outside of the eye, increased pressure in the eye called glaucoma, double vision, scar tissue inside the eye, and clouding of the eye's lens or cataract. Call your ophthalmologist right away if you notice any of the following problems after surgery. A decrease in your vision, increasing pain in your eye, increasing redness of your eye, swelling around the eye, any discharge from the eye, any new floaters, flashes of light, or other changes in your field of vision. Other treatment options may be available for your retinal detachment. Depending on your condition, these options could include a vitrectomy to remove the vitreous gel and replace it with a gas bubble. Another option is pneumatic retinopexy, where just a gas bubble is used to hold the retina in place. Your ophthalmologist can explain why he or she chose a sclerobuckle for your particular course of treatment. You don't have to be treated for your retinal detachment. However, without treatment, it is very likely you will lose vision in that eye. The main goal of treatment is to preserve your vision. Be sure to keep all appointments with your ophthalmologist after treatments. Also, if you have any changes in your vision, you should call your ophthalmologist right away. Monitoring your vision is a vital step toward the goal of preserving your sight.